When you think of a cactus, you probably imagine a spiky green plant that survives in the desert. You see them in cowboy movies, always playing a minor role. But what if I told you it's about to steal the show? By mimicking its water storing mechanism, we could transform fog into water and revolutionize the fight against water scarcity. At least that's what two researchers wondered. Could we harvest water from fog? They rolled up their sleeves and dove right into the challenge. After months of hard work and experimentation, they unveiled their breakthrough in a paper titled Fabrication of Hydrophilic and Hydrophobic Membranes Inspired by the Phenomenon of Water Absorption and Storage of Cactus. But let's take a moment to ask ourselves, why do we need to transform fog into water? Well, according to the World Health Organization, one in three people lack access to safe drinking water. And if the current trend continue, our global water demand is set to increase by about 55% by 2050. This means that every glass you drink and every shower you take could come at a higher cost, not just for you, but for our entire planet. At this point, the researchers turned to the humble cactus for inspiration. They began with a pet mesh. Think of it as a blank canvas and immersed it in a silicon dioxide solution to prepare and texturize the surface. They then dipped the mesh into an OTS solution, creating a water repelling layer, much like a non-stick coating on a frying pan. To finish the process, they sprayed the mesh with titanium dioxide and exposed it to UV light for 30 minutes. This treatment transformed the sprayed layer into a water-loving surface on top of the water-hating base, replicating the cactus's clever water harvesting design. After fabricating three dual-layer membranes with varying pore sizes, the researchers put them to the test. Interestingly, they found that Mesh 50, with the largest pores, outperformed the others, collecting 16.23 grams of water from fog in just one hour. They then scaled up this design and after a few tweaks, boosted the water collection to 22.34 grams per hour. To put that into perspective, imagine a patch roughly the size of a coffee table coaster harvesting about one and a half tablespoons of water. While that may not seem like much on its own, if you had 45 such patches working together, they could collectively gather nearly one liter of water every hour. Now, I think it's a really strong paper that shows a great proof of concept. That said, I would recommend the authors to better mimic the actual desert conditions in future experiments, instead of relying only on the humidifier. For example, setting up the system in a real desert environment and checking back the next day to measure how much water has been collected. All right, and now the meme of the week. Thank you all for watching. Take care. And be sure to check out our next video on innovative ways to harvest water from nature.